This sound is a sound of relief for Pelican Pub owner Josh Johnson. Probably one of the biggest stressors I've ever had in my life. For months, bars remain closed due to COVID-19 restrictions. I'm losing money. It's costing me every day about $150 to $200 a day just to be open on average. Tuesday, Governor John Bell Edwards announced bars can open once again at limited capacity. I'm very cautiously optimistic though about it. I'm, I'm worried that we could get shut down again. A feeling all too familiar for these bar owners. We're scared they're going to get us in and then two weeks later yeah. they're going to throw us back out. Right. Cottage Inn owner Tanya Harden says the only reason her bar survived was because of community support. I didn't have no more money, so we did a benefit, and that got us about four months for bills. These owners say the restrictions are unjust. We would go other places and sit in the bars, and we're shoulder to shoulder with people. I don't have a food permit, and if I did, I would have been able to operate in full capacity. I didn't know that we had a smart virus. What I mean by that is, how does the virus know to come in or not to come in the door when you have food involved? Through the struggles of staying afloat, these bar owners say they will persevere no matter the cost. This bar has been here a long time and I'm not giving it up. I'm not. Abby Rocha, NBC, Local 33 News. Abby, thank you. All bars can open at 25% capacity, but in parishes with a positivity rate below 5%, that's bumped up to 50% capacity. Again, these new rules officially go into effect tomorrow.